Hey guys, Tech Measure with the Lady for and in today's video, we're gonna walk you through some troubleshooting steps that you can take if your iPhone microphone is not working. And this step we're gonna do is gonna help you resolve any software-related issue that could be interfering with your mic not working. Again, these steps are the steps recommended by Apple that you can take and hopefully resolve your issue. And if it doesn't resolve your issue, we'll also let you know what else you can do. So first thing you wanna do is, of course, when you have an issue like a mic stopped working all of a sudden is to restart the phone. Now, we're not gonna do a basic restart. We're gonna do a forced restart, which will clear the cache and any sort of bug that the iPhone may be experiencing. So to do that on iPhone 8 and above, you're gonna simply press and release the volume up down on button really quick and then hold the side button on the right hand side till you see the Apple logo. So to do this in real time, we're gonna press and release the volume up and then press and release the volume down and then hold this big side button on our right hand side. As you can see, I'm not gonna slide to power it off. I'm just gonna wait till it forces the phone to completely shut down and then restart. And as you can see here, it's completely black. We're gonna keep on holding until we see the Apple logo let go and it is doing what's known as a force restart and it will clear up any software related issue that could be impacting your mic from not working or stop working all of a sudden. So we just wait till this process kicks in and then we'll move on to the next thing you can do and just give it a second and now test out your mic. So a good way to test out your mic we find is that if you have uh, the, uh, the app which is on by default on iPhone is voice memo. So if you open up voice memo, it's always good to use this because this allows you to use your mic and test it out. So we go recording something just to test it out. You can see this means the mic is picking up sound. If it wasn't picking up sound, for example, as you can see, it will be flat versus when it picks up the sound. And then you can go ahead and play it back. Of course, make sure your volume is up so you can hear the playback. See, it'll be flat versus one so each time you do a step just do that to kind of test it out to see if your mic is working now the next thing you want to do if that didn't fix your issue is simply check what is really common sometimes you could have some dust or some buildup that could block your mic actual physical mic on the phone for example on iphone 10s max here we're just gonna go ahead and wipe down any sort of dust possibly sometimes you can take a toothpick or something like that if it's clogging up this bottom piece. So make sure that's not dirty up top as well. Just clean out this high beat. And then even on the back on the phones here, there's gonna be a mic on this model. So you wanna make sure those are clean. Again, simple thing, but if you have a case that's interfering with it, sometimes it could block the mic at the bottom or the front, make sure you take off the case or even screen protector. Now those things, again, common sense sometimes, but it's good to always uh, remove a case and test out to see if that was the reason for your mic not working and then open up the voice memo app one more time and check it out. Now the next thing you want to do if your phone is not working and are having issues is you know remove any accessories that your phone might be having like for example if you're plugged into a charger take the charger out and the other thing you want to check is if you're connected to any devices through Bluetooth. So the thing to do that is go into settings and then you'll need see the option for Bluetooth here. Check that maybe if your Bluetooth is on, you can always turn it off to test the mic or keep it on. If there's a device, disconnect with that device and see what happens. So turn it off and then turn it off completely. Check out your mic, turn it back on, see if there's devices connected. Take, make sure you're off those devices. The reason why you do that is that a device sometimes connected might be trying to use the device mic. So and make sure that is not interfering with anything. Next thing you wanna do is pull down the control center here and then this time we're gonna go turn on airplane mode by clicking on that airplane mode give it a moment or two and then turn off airplane mode again now this kind of helps with the connectivity and sometimes it could have impact on the mic itself and check out see if your mic is working now the next thing to do if you're not having if you're having issues mic is actually use a headphone or if you have airpods connect your device the headphones, maybe the wireless one here, or if you have any sort of AirPods, connect to AirPods and test out the mic there. So connect to the AirPods and then open up the voice memo app as we mentioned and try speaking that recording something, see if it picks up the recording there and see if that resolves your issue. So that's another thing to check if it's not something maybe 
within the phone that's blocking or interfering with it. Now, the next thing you may be wondering, let's say if you have an app, for example, you are not able, if you're recording and the sound isn't coming through the app, you have to go ahead and check out the settings on the phone to see if that app is actually able to access your mic. So mic, camera, or security features that aren't activated default, the, the app actually has to request it. And to see what apps have current access to your mic, you can check that by going to settings. And once you go to settings, you wanna check out privacy and then you'll notice here, like camera here, you'll see an option for mic as well. And click on app clips, and this will show you apps that currently have access to your mic. As you can see, we don't have any app clips that have access to our mic, but if you have an app that you're looking to activate or have mic access, make sure it is listed here, as that is a way that could prevent the mic from being accessed on that app. Now, the next thing, you want to do if you're still having issues with your phone, Mike is actually going ahead and doing a software update. Now, this happens sometimes when new software updates are out, it might cause a previous version not to work and, and so forth. So it's always good to do a software update. To do that, simply go into settings, general, software update, and once you go into software update, make sure you're connected to internet or data You'll either notice there's the update out that you can update to, for example, we can update this phone to 15.5, which could potentially fix some issues. You could just hit that download and install, make sure you're connected to a power source and be patient with the software update. It could take you somewhere between 20 to 30 minutes to even up to an hour, depending on your internet connection. After that, if go ahead and test the mic, and if it's still not working, the next thing you can do is gonna be a little bit more effort, but it's going to be a backup and factory reset. Again, it's one of those more effort consuming thing you can do for troubleshooting, but sometimes it might work, might not. To do that, simply connect your phone to your computer or iCloud backup. Once you backed up, go ahead, make sure you're really backed up because you don't want to proceed the next step, which is going to be wiping out the phone and you'll lose all of your data unless you have a backup to pull your data back, go into general, and then this time go to transfer or reset iPhone. This is on iOS 15, so it's, the menu is gonna be slightly different, but you'll see this option to erase all content and settings. Now, this again will factory reset and delete everything locally on the phone. That's why we're saying before you even do that, or think about it, make sure you back up your phone on iTunes or your computer somehow, or your iCloud, so if you don't know what to do with the backup, don't do this. So back up, watch our other video where we show you how to back it up. And then you're simply gonna do a reset here by just clicking on that and then hitting continue next and it will just wipe out the phone and then you'll bring the phone back by doing a restore from the backup and hopefully it works. Now, if all of this stuff didn't work for you, what could possibly be the issue? Well, most likely if none of these work, it's gonna be something actually related with the internal hardware part of the mic itself. In that case, you need to actually take it to the Apple store or authorized Apple retailer that fixes phones so they can actually go ahead and test out the act and diagnose the phone, see if it's hardware related, which most of the case it will be, which again, sometimes there might be recalls to get it replaced free, or if you have Apple Care or something like that, they might cover it. Other times you might have to pay for a repair. So hopefully this video is helpful, and if this video is helpful, please make sure to like and subscribe button. Thanks for watching, guys. See you guys next time.